hello friends and welcome to my channel this has been a while i have not uploaded any videos on this channel so so i have decided to make one in this video i am going to show you what to do if you have purchased a new xbox one controller that is the wireless one which comes with a dongle for the pc windows 10 and you are facing one issue it is called the error code 10 with this device what happens is basically when you try to connect the device uh, with the help of the supplied uh, receiver of xbox one it will not connect and in the device manager menu it will show the device not working sorry the device is unable to start my this fix that i am going to show you will solve this issue permanently so first of all i would like to explain it so if you right click on my computer and go inside manage and device manager under uh, network adapter option you will find that the xbox wireless one adapter for windows it may or may not show you in your device if your windows 10 don't have the proper driver for this particular controller what happens is there will be a small triangle just below this icon and when you right click on it and go to properties here you will see the device is unable to start properly and the error code will be error code 10 one more important thing when this problem appears you will not going to see this power management option right so first of all i would recommend you to right click on this icon the xbox one or it in your case it can be a question mark unknown device whatever it is and uh, go to uninstall this device and you have to check this delete the driver software for this device and click uninstall once you uninstall it next you have to restart your windows after you restart your windows in the yeah you have to go to the device manager again and you will find that the um, windows have already tried to install the driver for this particular device and it may fix your problem or it may not fix your problem in the next screen so after you restart your uh, pc again you have to right click on it go to update driver now you can search automatically for updated driver software if you are connected with the internet it is supposed to search for the necessary driver available in microsoft windows update database and it should collect the driver properly if it fails to collect the driver you have to browse my computer for driver software and in the next screen you have to select this option let me pick a list from the drivers since i have the driver it is showing like this in your case it may show like this it may be a huge list of dri available drivers in your pc so you have to go to microsoft and here you are supposed to see the xbox wireless uh, adapter for windows if it is not available in your pc first uh, <coughs> update your windows 10 uh, windows 10 and then you check <coughs> it, this should be available in the um, uh, driver menu you have to install it manually and once the driver is installed properly again you have to right click on it now you can see the triangle uh, will no longer be there in the icon so right click on it go to properties and now you will be able to see this option power management so once you get this power management option you have to disable it right allow the computer to turn off this device to save power this is basically is the reason why it sometimes fails to start properly once you disable this power saving option for this particular adapter this problem should be fixed for your pc so i am clicking ok now i am ready to go it, it will work uh, without any issues and even after doing this uh, your problem still remains in that case please comment in the comment section below let me know what uh, what the specific problem you are facing in your pc and uh, basically there are two steps first make sure you have updated your windows 10 properly and uh, next 
you are following the basic step to connect the controller with the wireless receiver it is exclusively for those controller uh, which comes with a receiver or you are using a dedicated receiver in your pc to connect the wireless controller this is it for this video guys hope this uh, little small tips helps and uh, if it really helps please give this video a thumbs up like and share this video with your friends if they are facing similar problem and uh, please put your comment in the comment section below in case you are having any issues related to the connection and this type of uh, error code 10 with the xbox one controller so this is it thanks for watching